evening. He's considered among the most dangerous in the maximum security unit. Michael Cummins is accused in one of the deadliest mass killings in Tennessee history. Eight murdered and his lawyer is now asking for three separate trials. The likely defense, an insanity plea. And as News Channel 5's Nick Barris tells us, Cummins' conduct behind bars may be a clue to his state of mind. Watch for these exclusive new details. Michael Cummins will stand trial, possibly three trials, depending on a judge's decision. But based on the physical evidence and DNA, investigators say that there's little doubt he's responsible for eight murders. Not only complex, but horrific. That's how TBI director David Rausch described the primary crime scene in spring of 2019. I mean, there was blood, there, there, there was last right, there was, it was just awful. Authorities found six bodies in a Westmoreland home and two other victims at separate locations. The prime suspect, Michael Cummins. Those dead include his parents and a 12-year-old girl. The evidence is overwhelming. Cummins' footprints at one bloody scene. He was caught with a victim's car, and there is DNA. A strong case made stronger because one of the victims, Cummins' own grandmother, survived a brutal beating. Her memory of what happened has improved, and she is expected to testify against him at trial. With all the information we have, uh, we will uh, see that justice is done. The defense wants separate trials for each of the three murder scenes. Prosecutors want one, saying they're all linked. Whether one or three, Cummins will likely seek an insanity plea. He's held without bond and is considered to be one of the most dangerous inmates in the Riverbend Maximum Security Prison. News Channel 5 has learned he's tried setting fires in his cell, earlier this year attempted to attack a guard, and is a constant risk to hurt himself or others. Cummins is held in a supermax pod and is considered both homicidal and suicidal and is never moved without leg irons, handcuffs, and a belly chain. Prosecutors will be seeking the death penalty. Nick Barris, News Channel 5. Thanks, Nick. And the legal wrangling continues in this case. The judge will decide next month if Cummins will face one or three separate trials.